Hello Saturn Mechanics. This is yet another instructional video on repairing the dreaded intake manifold water leak that seems to be a design flaw in the Saturns with the plastic manifold. This video will show you how to repair the leak without removal of the manifold using a Dremel tool. If you do not have one, I highly recommend you get one. They come in handy for many jobs. This video will show you what to remove and then skip to the next item. Most of you will know how to remove the few parts that are removed anyway. Once I get to the actual cutting of the manifold, I will leave the video running. Okay, let's get to it. Step one is removal of the air cleaner duct. Uh, you don't have to remove the entire box where the filter goes. You just have to remove the one screw and the air connections in here. Next, you'll need to remove this hose here. That's from your radiator coolant expansion tank. And this nut here it holds your fuel line in place just so you can get it out of the way. Well instead of taking the bottom hose completely off this one here, what I did was I slid it back about a quarter of an inch or so to the right still on the line I didn't want to lose all that radiator water and coolant and I also you'll notice I tied off this line here goes through. I tied that off to get it out of the way of the Dremel so when I start Dremeling I won't have that in the way to possibly cut it. So now what you want to do once you move this out of the way you can see here there's a gap between this piece here and the hose. What you want to do is you drill a hole back here so you have a place to stop you take your Dremel, Dremel it all the way down and all the way down on that side and get this piece out. You can slide this hose on further, clamp it down and that should resolve the problem if your split is back in here, which it normally is. So I'm going to go ahead and start the drilling here and then cut along the lines like I said and see if that works. Now you've got a little tight space here to work with. So be very careful. This Dremel is kind of noisy, but hopefully I can get down to where I need to get to. Make sure you wear some kind of safety glasses if possible, because this plastic may get in your face.
Now you'll take a screwdriver, something to that effect, and kind of push this out. And the other way. You feel for any rough spots, there's a few. So now you get the Dremel out with a sander, or you can use sandpaper, and get that rough piece out. That should do it. And then you slide your hose. You've got plenty of hose down here. You just slide your hose right down the line and put you a couple of hose clamps, one on the end and one maybe right in here somewhere. And that should solve your problem. Now hopefully this helps out some people so you don't have to take the whole manifold and the fuel rail and everything else out of the way. This is a much quicker, easier solution, I believe.